Steven and Rap here. Welcome to the Guilty Coaches channel. <laughs> what a year it's been. 2020 has been a strange one. It's had its ups, it's had its downs, it's had its round and round and rounds. Uh, absolutely crazy year. Um, we're always in the mindset of we win, we win, we learn from the wins, we learn from the losses, um, and as long as you're set on learning, you really can't lose. Exactly. So, that was the year that was. It was very different for a lot of people. Uh, it was very different for us too, but we made the most of it. We did some strange stuff, we did some awesome stuff, and we did some stuff that might feel like a waste of time. <laughs> <laughs> Nothing's a waste of time. As long as you're laughing, it's never a waste of time. Ever, ever, ever. So, um, as we're now in 2021, we thought it's it's good to look back. Let's uh, delve into what we've done this year, uh, last year, should I say, and, um, and reminisce. Yeah. So the very start of the year, we set out to um, challenge our members for our online membership, members of our membership, to lose 1,000 kilograms, the ton challenge. The one ton challenge. Um, and, you know, that was quite an ambitious goal. We thought, you know, I had to do something. Our passion is in helping people. Um, weight loss is the best we know how to do that at the moment. Um, and we thought, you know what, 1,000 kilograms. And we're glad to say, smashed it. Which means there's going to be a fresh ton challenge for 2021. <laughs> yeah, so I, um, if you want to get in on this ton challenge, become a part of our membership, drop us a message and um, on, on Facebook and we'll chat to you about how that goes about. There were a few videos at the start of the year. Um, yeah, we had um, some, um, some weird uh, videos um, <laughs> as we normally do we have this uh, ideas of videos now what was the one get out, the, get out of your own way yeah, it was move get out the way <laughs> <laughs> I can't believe that was 2020 it seems old it didn't start like that it started no, off no. with quite a philosophical get out of your own way we had this we always have the same idea and then we come at it from different angles yeah yeah <laughs> <laughs> Imagine all the Get out the way, bitch! Get out the way! <laughs> <laughs> I'm going to find out what song that is. So then, of course, lockdown happened. The pandemic hit us like a freight train and we were separated. So everybody was separated, yeah. right? So unfortunately, our video creation just went downhill. Mm -hmm. um, it, it's, you know, luckily for our members, everything's online so that our our work work didn't really get affected but our video creation something that we love we love speaking to a, a larger audience inspiring people across the globe we just couldn't do it no. so we drank a lot of whiskey in the meantime i shaved my head i grew my hair <laughs> <laughs> whatever hair he lost i gained <laughs> So yeah, basically that was um, that was our lockdown, if you like. Yeah, yeah, we certainly did drink a lot of whiskey. Yeah, went through quite a bit. I had a whiskey o'clock spinner that always landed. Because <laughs> of gravity. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> and it's like, is it whiskey o'clock? <laughs> yep. It's whiskey o'clock. Yeah, that's right. So, uh, so yeah, during lockdown, um, we, we didn't do much, unfortunately. But as soon as we were able, we were reunited. Yep. In the Kilted Coaches um, way we know best. And then we just gained momentum for the second half of 2020. From that point onwards, we had a new influx of new members, which was great. Lots of people losing weight, which also polished off the ton challenge we mentioned earlier. And we got a new office. We did get this new office. We, this is something we're really proud of in 2020. Yep. We met Joanna Lumley. We didn't just meet her. We got to work with her too. We filmed with Joanna Lumley one of the one of the, the the nicest kindest most sort of compassionate people in the tv industry not to mention she's hot for being 70 <laughs> and emma 
Um, and we got to, to film with her in, of all places, Glencoe, Glen Glen which is one of our favourite places in Scotland. Yeah, it was, it was a beautiful day, it was a fantastic experience, we really enjoyed it, and that footage will come out soon. I think February, March time they said. Mm, I think so, yeah. yeah. Then things started to get a bit freaky deaky. Um, we, uh, at one point we were getting bombarded, not bombarded, in a positive way with little tasks. We were on the news and not being hunted by the police. <laughs> <laughs> An opportunity, taking the ways to exercise at home when they were specifically not allowed to work for more than a We got asked to do a bit of filming for a special effects company. Yep, that we never seen the footage of. <laughs> <laughs> they said, in fact, yes, they said, we can't pay you for this work, however, we do the special effects for all the movies and the TV shows they worked on, yeah. Outlander, and they worked on all these kind of cool movies, um, and they're like, we'll give you some awesome footage, we want you running through the woods in your kilts, in slow motion with smoke machines and everything else going on, it's going to be amazing footage, and we'll pay you by giving you the footage that you can use for yourself. So we didn't get paid. Because <laughs> we never got the footage. We never got the footage. In fact, we never heard from all since. No, yeah, no, not, not, not a peep. No, not a So, um, should we mention them by name? Mm. If this company is watching, please send us some footage because <laughs> <laughs> that was a fun day. We loved every one of you. Um, it, was, it was a great day. Uh, and we kind of want to be paid. <laughs> <laughs> Then, uh, the tail end, the tail end of the year, we dressed up as dinosaurs! With tails! <laughs> um, Vikings too? Yeah, we pretended we were Vikings. It's funny, because in the, the comments, mindset. people are like, are Scottish people now Vikings? We're like, no, it's a mindset, but... The yeah. comments make us laugh, they really do. Since when are all Scotsmen Vikings? <laughs> Pretty sure we didn't say that in the video. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it's hilarious. We do get a lot of joy from the comments, from, from the nice comments that most of you leave. We mm. love reading them, but when you get somebody who's not so nice, it's even funnier. There's a brilliant line from, I think it's the movie Snatch, and he says, um, never underestimate the predictability of stupidity. <laughs> and I always have that at the forefront of my mind when I look into yeah. the comments section on YouTube. Yeah. <laughs> Uh, don't feed the trolls though, don't feed the trolls. No, uh, right. You best just to ignore them, <coughs> have a little giggle to yourself and move on. So 2021 for us has got some exciting projects. We'll be taking on new members to our online membership. There's that member membership again. Um, we'll also be filming for our TV series, Secret Body. Yeah, so that's like something that happened in 2020. We've got confirmation of the, the series oh, of coming around. So. Yeah. Um, that, was a, that was a major thing at the start of the year. Yeah. And then it was brought forward, so hopefully we'll be filming that soon. Yep. Uh, but yes, the, the main thing for us over the next few months is actually our membership. We have two intakes per year, um, so the, 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 the first intake of 2021 is happening now. Uh, for the next six weeks, the doors will be open. Uh, if you're interested, please drop us a message. If not, then please keep taking inspiration from our normal social media videos. Mm -hmm. So 2021, Mr. Clark, what will it hold for us, we wonder? What will it hold for us indeed? Fun. I was, I fitness. <laughs> <laughs> and frisky? Oh, I meant for whiskey. <laughs> frisky for whiskey. Like, ooh. Frisky whiskey! <laughs> uh, 2021, um, we said 2020 was going to be awesome and to be honest, it was. It was a big learning year for everybody. I know it sucked for a lot of people, and for other people, it was just fucking awesome. Um, but regardless of what you, how you feel about it, it was great for learning and for your, your own personal growth. So we look back at 2020 with fondness, and we look forward to 2021, whatever it brings. So if you're looking forward to seeing more of our content this year, don't forget to like, comment, and ring the notification bell and all the other jazz. Yeah, let us know in the comments your thoughts, your feelings, and your emotions for 2021. Go deep. Balls deep. <laughs> <laughs> what was that? Every time. <laughs> <laughs>